case about Web 2 and Web 3. So I went into a 3 days research to actually discover the differences between these two technologies. And I discovered that Web 3 is all about decentralization. And you'll be asking, what is decentralization? Decentralization simply means a system that is not owned by a particular individual or company. So for the one question which have stuck with me from the very first time I heard about Web3 is if I had to throw away all my Web2 skills to actually go ahead and learn Web3. Well, the answer is no because I found out that Web3 applications are just full stack applications with decentralized technology. So whether it's front end or back end that you're currently doing, you don't need to throw any of this out. You just need to integrate Web3. In fact, Web3 developers are actually Web2 developers who went ahead to learn Web3 technologies. That's confusing, right? Follow me for more videos.